from our first official look at She-Hulk with the recent trailer, there was already a lot of controversy surrounding the end product, because apparently, still being three and a half months out from release means that you're supposed to have the look finalized and everything is supposed to look like it's complete. Which doesn't make sense, because if it was, then it would be ready to go. Yeah, let's talk about the CG improvements that are actively happening, and we can literally see them with our own eyes, and, well, talk about what exactly this means, and why we've done this same song and dance at least 800 times before. So at this point, you can go years back to the first look at Zack Snyder's Justice League, like the OG before Joss Whedon and everything, when the entire internet was ripping Cyborg apart. I was here defending it, saying, guys, the film is still like a year away. It's early CG. Stop this. Just, just stop hating CG because CG is literally worked on till a few weeks out from the official release of the film. TV shows are literally working up until a couple of days before the episode is ready to go. WandaVision was literally airing the first three episodes while they were still working on the final two. They outright confirmed this in interviews. It's cutting it very close. So I understand that some of the CG on She-Hulk isn't that good. I even talked about it when I did my initial reaction to it. I said, I see the problems and I don't think it looks that great right now but you have to take note of why. The fact that all the shadowing wasn't there, that they didn't put all the details, that they didn't take the time to put in all the pores properly and everything because that takes more rendering time and they just wanted to trailer out because again, things were starting to leak in relation to the series. Now, Disney over the last couple weeks since that trailer has uploaded new versions of clips, different TV spots and everything and if we start looking at those, well, here you go. Here's some great examples put online by various websites and, well, Instagrams and social media accounts. So, I mean, if you look at it right here, look at the right-hand side, notice the difference. I mean, yes, again, it's being captured from a YouTube video, but look at the amount of actual, like, shading that's happening more and shadows and well, pours on her skin and the detail. It's already gotten better. If you want to see what I'm talking about here, let's look at the face. Look at the right-hand side where you see more of the actual ridges and like eye bags and everything on there, right? Like the way her face moves, you can see wrinkles and things like that. There's more shadowing. There's more hue to the actual hair that's realistic because again, we're still some two months out. I mean, here's another example. Look at the top, look at the bottom. This is honestly the best example I've seen yet. Just look at the staggering difference. Just look at how much of a difference it makes when you actually show some of those, you know, details a little bit closer. When you put a little bit more grit on there on the skin like they're supposed to be because you're doing final passes on a CG farm. And for those of you that don't know, sometimes one second, yes, one second of CG can take close to a week to render. That's why these giant render farms are literally loaded with thousands of computers and servers that are working overtime. So you get results like this that look better. So what I'm trying to say is, no, she's not going to look like Shrek when it comes out. Because that's what everybody's talking about, looking like Fiona. The thing here is, you just got to kind of accept that the CG's changing. And they're still working on a TV budget, which obviously is going to get better as we get closer to it. But, you know, let's wait till the final product, which is what I always say about CG. Wait till the final product, because the fact that people are just throwing hundreds of hardworking people under the bus while they're literally not finished yet just doesn't sit right with me. 